Ghost Nation, what's up, y'all? So check this out. Here it is. We're finna do some black tiger shrimp. I'm gonna stuff them with crab. It's about to go down. As you see, I picked up some black tiger shrimp. Try to cut up some veggies, some mini peppers, some purple onion, and there we go, some lump crab. So let's get it. All right, so I'm gonna take the lump crab right here. Pop this open. Y'all see that? I'm going to add this in here. Break it on down. Right here, I'm going to add the pepper, the purple onion, red onion, however whatever you want to call it. We're going to add uh, some seasonings. We're going to do some black pepper. Oregano. Some lemon pepper. Add some obey. A little onion powder. And of course some garlic powder. Lately I've been really digging this seasoning right here. So I'm adding a little of this. It's a mixture of garlic, ginger, pineapple, and mango. Just gonna add some good flavor up in there. Then we're gonna mix this up. Yeah, I don't wanna watch me mix, so what I do is I'll mix this up, I'll come right back and let you see. So look, check this out. As you see, we mixed it really good. Everything's in there real good. We get some rich crackers, y'all. This was gonna give it the consistency. Now, y'all could use um, breadcrumbs if you choose, but me, I'm going to use these reds. Elaine, can you come in, please? So, see, this is a whole pack of Ritz crackers broken down. You can food process them, or you can either crumble it by hand, either or. But you want to get it to this kind of consistency so you can mold it into the shrimp. Otherwise, it, they won't stick. Now, you can do these two ways, too. You can bake them and fry them. I'm going to bake mine, but you can fry these too. All right, y'all. As you see, I went ahead. I de these shrimp. They de -vein, They clean. So now what we're going to do is we're going to start assembling them. Assembling them. Okay. So I did get these at Costco, if y'all didn't notice. They had a good sale going on them. So... Pretty much, it goes just like this. You grab some of this crab, sit here, and you mold it around the shrimp, like this. Now, if I was gonna fry these, what I would do is I would have an egg wash next to me, dip them in egg wash, and then dip them in a batter, and go ahead and, and hit them in the oil. But right now, this is how you're going to do it. You're going to assemble it just like this. Y'all see this? So I'm going to keep on going, and I'm going to have them all assembled. I'm going to put them in the pot, in this pan, and iron skillet here. And then I'll be right back with y'all. Okay, y'all, now look. Here it is. I've got all the shrimp wrapped. Everything looking good here. I'm going to toss these in the oven for anywhere from 25 to 30. Let's go. Let's go. So we just pulled the shrimp out. And there you go. That's how they look. Stuffed shrimp. Now let's plate them. So here's that plate of stuffed, stuffed shrimp, y'all. 
Here we go. Until next time, like, subscribe, and comment. Please share these videos. <laughs> Hope y'all have a great one. I'm out.